Sometimes I begin this personal investigation into how it is that one thing or another ends up in my memory. And I don't mean on a neurological level. I'm talking about my curiosity as to why this or that stays in my head. And unfortunately for me, up until this point, I have never found a sensible answer to any such questions. What I do have is a conclusion, or I come to a conclusion, and it's usually the same one, and that is, it is simply better, easier on the life for me to accept and enjoy the fact the memories are there, rather than spend a lot of energy uh, seeking out their origin. Now, I don't know how this is for you, but for me, these memories appear as um, movies of my life of different length. And the stronger the memory, the more vivid the film. It's shown in very, very high definition, all around sound, true life color, all that stuff. And when the memory is vague, it's almost as if I'm trying to see ghosts through this really dense fog. I can see movement, uh, there are muffled sounds, a lot of static. I know something is there, and it often wants to pull you in towards it. Um, so that's the other end of uh, the memory spectrum. And it doesn't matter what they are or how they are, I must say I'm really happy they exist. Because goodness knows the number of times I'm writing away and I'm trying to understand something. And the only way I can find a narrative solution is to go into the memory banks, dig something out, and voila, there you are. Another story saved, another passage saved, what you will.